mold is a naturally occurring element. Outside, mold helps to decompose dead materials, like leaves and trees, and leaf mold is often used in organic gardening. However, mold in the home is another issue altogether. How does it get into homes? There is mold everywhere, in dust and floating in the air. Molds have microscopic-sized spores that are present in the air, and when they blow into a house, they can become a problem. If they land on a wet surface or are in a moist environment, they multiply. Mold can affect indoor air quality and can irritate the skin, nose, eyes, and lungs. Mold exposure has been linked to respiratory issues like asthma or allergic complaints. Sensitive people who touch mold can have a reaction. Mold eventually ruins the materials on which they grow, such as furniture and wood products. The longer it grows, the worse the damage. Homes that are built to be airtight can result in trapped moisture that can't escape, which could result in mold on walls and underneath floors. Bathrooms are a common source of mold since they are frequently damp or wet in areas. Good ventilation, such as a fan or open window, will help dry the area, and cleaning frequently will cut down on mold growth. What to do about it? Prevention is the first line of defense to control mold, and prevention means controlling moisture, because mold cannot grow without water or moisture. Mold can be found anywhere as long as there is moisture. There are different types of mold, and they can grow on any type of material, from wood and carpet to food and paper. If mold is found, it must be removed, and the source of moisture needs to be located and eliminated. The area should be dried, repaired or replaced as necessary, and checked to be sure there will be no further moisture problems. Maintain indoor humidity at between 30 and 60 percent or less using proper ventilation, exhaust fans, air conditioners, and dehumidifiers. According to the Environmental Protection Agency, EPA, if the area affected by mold is 10 square feet or less, it can be fixed by following the mold cleanup techniques for mold cleanup in your home. The techniques include repairing leaks and drying the area, scrubbing mold off hard surfaces with water and detergent, then dry thoroughly. Absorbent surfaces that have mold should be replaced. Do not paint over mold. Instead, clean it up and let the area dry completely first. If you have valuable items that have mold, you might want to consult a specialist for cleaning techniques. If the heating, ventilation, air conditioning system, HVAC, has mold, don't run the system until you have it checked out by a professional. If you are experiencing health issues that could be related to mold, consult your health professional. If there is a large amount of mold, the EPA guide, Mold Remediation in Schools and Commercial Buildings, is available at epa.gov mold. It has information useful for homes and apartments. There are no EPA regulations on the acceptable amount of mold and its contaminants at this time.